Alright guys, how's it going? It's this week's recommended Blender downloads. This is where I scour the internet looking for the best free downloads for your downloading and Blender pleasure. Now I'm fully aware it's just after Black Friday and you might be a little bit like myself because you've just randomly bought add-ons that you might never ever use and you've left yourself a little bit poor. So hopefully these add-ons will kind of lighten the weight a bit. And we're going to kick this off with a golden oldie and it's the Spaceship Generator. And I believe this has been updated to work with 2.8 and above. And it's excellent if you just want to quickly generate a spaceship. Throw it in the background of the scene. Nobody will be any wiser. So if you like to generate spaceships, Spaceship Generator's for you. Remember the link is in the description down below. And let's move this over to a brand new application. And it's called Aqueduct Asset Manager. And it was released on November the 27th. And essentially what this is, is it's a software application with a Blender plugin. And it's basically a glorified asset manager and it's looking pretty damn good to be honest. It's available on GitHub for free or you can buy it on Blender Market. Now I'll be completely honest, when I first set this up it was a bit of a pain in the ass. But once it was working it worked pretty damn good and I suggest you check it out. And I'm just kind of throwing this one into the mixer. Now, I know you have Node Wrangler that kind of sets up PBR materials, but this add-on helps managing PBR materials and it's called the Material Applier. Now, I love little scripts, things that just kind of make your workflow and your life just a little bit easier. And this is Open OS Browser from Blender Browser Context Menu. So essentially what you do is you set the file path and you can quickly jump to the file browser inside of Blender. Now, will it change your life? Probably not, but will it make your life a little bit easier? I hope so. And let's move it over to Gumroad because there's some classic stuff here. And this is a Mercedes CSX AMG rig car. I'm a BMW guy myself, as you already know, I'm a bit of a b**ker. So this might be good if you want to kind of practice your car scenes. And this is from Ryan King R. I might have reviewed this last week, I can't remember. But always check out people's pages because there's some really good content. And this is Create Your Own Blender Mac Camps and it's a kind of free download. And I really do like brainchild.pl. And this is updated bonus content so it actually has a video with it it's, and it's essentially ready to use foliage, a grass, blender substance and there is some really cool stuff in here as well you definitely worth checking this one out and another great resource is from Curtis Holt. Curtis has just released Holt Tools. It's essentially just a kind of helper tool that sits in the properties. Just kind of gives you access to things and speeds up a lot of your workflow. Definitely worth checking out the page as well. Curtis has a lot of really nice stuff. And this is from Salvador. And this is a Snout Blender rig. And there's a Lily Blender rig as well. Now, I don't know if these are legal or not. But hey, grab them while we can. And this is from Blender Pirate. Eve Shadowcatcher. Thank you very much Blender Pirate, or aka Blender Brit. Definitely worth grabbing that one as well. So I'm going to finish this video off with a little bit of fun to be honest. And this is the Asteroids Blender Node Editor game. So you can essentially play Asteroids inside of the Blender Node Editor. And this is from the same developer as the Logo Tracer, the anti seam Definitely worth checking out this guy's work. Do me a favour guys, like your video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Please support third party developers, you know what to do. Take care.